baby, 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 baby. Y'all don't get tired of Miss Storm, y'all. I got so much content. But I swear, as I'm putting out other content on these other mommies, then something up in these streets catch my attention. And baby, Peaches went live and it really caught my attention. Now, I'm going to say this. I keep getting two questions constantly in the comments and DMs. The number one thing that people ask me, is Fifi and Peach in this together? I have to say no because that's all I know. I have asked Fifi three or four times, and usually when you ask a question, right, you start having a thought. So I'm keeping it real. I'm moving Fifi out the equation. I got to do my reaction thing, and I got to keep it real because that's what I do for y'all. That's number one. Number two, everyone keeps saying, is this real? From my knowledge, it is. Do I know what, if anything happened? Let me just say if. Between Fifi and Peach and all of this, no, I do not. I tried to get it out of her. You see how Fifi was and very hesitant on the live last night. So that's as far as I can get with it. So now I'm going to remove this whole thing out the equation. I'm going to look at Fifi and I'm going to look at Peach as people I will react off of. Sorry, Fifi. And I'm going to just say the truth. Because, baby, something in the buttermilk ain't clean about what Peach just did. Some in the buttermilk ain't clean, baby. First off, before we even get into it, y'all, we have to introduce this man. Uh-huh, Wood, that's been off the hook. Not over here, baby. You are for the streets, babe. And let me tell you something, honey. Oh, Woody Wood, all your <laughs> hustling and shit, all your wife did just now was say that you were for the Florida streets, honey. She didn't say you ain't for no streets. She pretty much just said... He's for the Florida streets. Uh-huh. He's for the in-state streets. He wants the in-state women, baby. That's one thing I took off of that live. Honey, bunches of... Oh, he is out here fishing. Uh-huh. This boy is out here fishing. Uh-huh. In the Florida waters. We cannot make this up. I tell you. He is out there catching them, reeling them in, and doing everything. So if y'all caught this live, okay... That Peach did. Let me say one thing. Peach looks awful. And now, you see I stopped laughing? Because I don't think that's funny. She looks stressed out. She looks depressed. She looks puffy-eyed. She looks like she is at her wit's end. I think she went live because she was at her wit's end. She tries to laugh it off and deflect it off of her. At the end of the day, we can all tell that she is miserable and she is upset. So either way we want to swing that, it is I, you know this is my thing i can't hope and wish and pray for nobody else anymore all i can say is when she's tired she's going to be tired and she's going to leave okay let me say that but then she goes on to say this well my husband's phone number got dropped and i know who dropped it it was fifi but then she turned around and she said well my husband number been out here so you know, and women hit him up all the time. I gave him a shout out on Facebook and then women start calling him. Then she went off to the phone number, was on the t-shirt and then women was calling him. So if this is the case that it's a repeat thing, y'all, I'm just throwing it all up. If this is a repeat thing of women calling him, then why did you get on live to address it and put it on Fifi? That's, look, that's all I got. to That's just a valid question. Okay. Then, all right, you said on there, you said, I could grab his phone right now and show y'all all the women and all the things that's being said. And then it was like she wanted to reach for it, but she going to say, well, I don't know what my device is. And the whole time, Wood is sitting back there just like himself, skinning, grinning. He ain't saying much. He ain't throwing his opinion in. He's acting all silent. He's acting all slow. You know, and at the end of the day, Peach, if you can hold on, let me just say this. Peach can hold on to that man's phone until the screen cracks. You can hold it tight. You can snuggle with it. You can put it under the pillow. You can drop it between the sheets, between the bed. Honey, you can have a tracker on it. But when he gets it back, okay, when he gets it back or when he thinks he can get away with it, this ain't got nothing to do with Fifi. This got what to do with these other women that are in the phone. You think, okay, if they say, baby, I'm in Florida, that he ain't going to do it because you didn't say. Uh-huh. Peach didn't say. No, my husband is faithful. She said, my husband doesn't like stuff like that over the phone. You you know, he likes you to be in state. And then I caught yesterday, too, when she said when they were cooking, right? She said, I ain't worried about her. We ain't even in the same state. 
First off, I don't want a man that would want another woman in the very first place, Peach. It doesn't matter if she's in the state. Doesn't matter if she's in the country. At the end of the day, they create trains, planes, helicopters, cars, so that it can happen. So I wouldn't want any of that coming in my home whatsoever. And it's just the mentality that you put on it. You're over there now swinging it like, oh, I'm the victim. Y'all want to break my marriage. Y'all want to do this. Y'all want to do that. Before you came on this platform, your husband, let's call a spade a spade. Because see, Wood is really getting away with it. And he's just, you know, slithering off to the side. But let's call a spade a spade, baby. Because before you came on this platform, because you ain't been on here 16 years, right? He had an outside child on you. That's, that, that's the truth. That's not alleged. That's not what we heard. That could be. That is the truth. Then he has a younger child. So while you were on here, he did it again. Then it's been numerous. Girl, you like it. You like it. You like it, baby. You said that. Then she went down the list and she said, most of the time, Mitch is in the same state. And you know, they going to want money to be quiet. And then we got to do this. I mean, you was given the mistress handbook play by play. So that also lets me know that this is not your first go round. And you are just okay with it. So at this point, all of this that I'm doing and I'm feeling bad for you, all I can say is this. Peaches McIntyre has left the building. Her body might be standing there, y'all. Her mouth might be moving. But honey, she has left the building. I do not understand why she does not like counseling, believe in counseling, but baby, that's going to save you right about now. Baby, when I tell you that Wood is sitting there being the pimp of the year. He is being the player of the year. He is getting all the fun. He's literally over there and he's got his cake and he's eating it too. He's getting um, money, oxtails. Uh, his wife is sticking to him like glue, but he knows when he gets his phone back, baby, it's popping. It's popping. It's popping and dropping. And then I had, um, I listened to everything. I've been trying to listen to every you know, side of the uh, borders here, there, everywhere, certain reactions and things of that nature. And I've been seeing a lot of people say that they think that um, Peach was the one texting Fifi towards the end of it. And I do too, because I said that last night. So that's no Tino Shay. I think at some point, Peach found the phone, found what was going on, maybe had a tracker or a device or some kind of app. And then she took up from there because of the way he spoke. But my question is, at what point, okay, did she find the messages? Was it before all of the, you know, swinging and danging and pictures became? Or was it after? The way she's acting, I'm going to feel as though it's after. Because now after, it seems like from the receipts that I'm looking at, it seems like after the pictures and things were exchanged, then the conversation kind of changed to, you need to get here, I'm going to pay for your ticket type of deal. Um, this is where I want you to come to. When are you going to come? You even set a date of September 9th. I mean, this is what I'm seeing for the receipts. It kept going really fast. It went from casual laid back conversation. You know how it is when you're talking to somebody. Oh, this is me. This is you. What we going to do when we meet to like get here right now. Get here right now. Uh huh. This is where I want you to come. So I'm going to say at some point, I think she stepped in, found the phone, and this is what was going on. This is all that I can come up with off the top of my head. And I'm going to say that. I think that Peach knows very well what is going on. I think she is paying very dumb to it. And her way of doing everything, especially when it comes to wood, is let me get on here. Be sad about it the first day because she was on here for two whole days crying. After I get done being sad, then I'm going to start telling everybody how phenomenal I am because I need to build myself up, okay? So I'm going on here. I'm a genius. I'm a phenomenal peach, and I got to pump myself up because I just came down from below. You know, I'm down here in the gutters. I was just laying in the bed, and I was crying. I was just sitting over here, and I couldn't even get out my uh, husband's name out, you know, my mouth without tears falling out of my eyes type of deal. So then you, you bragged on yourself, okay? After you bragged on yourself, you then went and started sticking up under him like glue. We all know that it was the phone um, of wood that was called, but then Peach answered it. So then that's another reason why I say, yes, yeah, she knew it was happening. She's keeping up with the headlines and she's trying to get ahead of it. That's just how I feel. You know, blame me if I'm wrong, because I don't know. I'm just telling you my opinion. This is my reaction, okay? But all of a sudden, you're hanging around your husband yesterday and you pumped up, you amped up. 
Oh, this is my man. Yeah, we know he cheated. Uh huh. F you, Fifi, and you kissing on him, and y'all sucking down oxtail bones, and y'all about to do the damn thing. Y'all talking about y'all kids, y'all talking about y'all family. But then, what happens between yesterday and today that you wake up and you turned into a rotten peach, a old sour apple, because you woke up this morning down and getting on your mama, blasting on your mama. See, this is classic deflection on peaches part she is deflecting it onto her mother onto her family because if i'm mad at my family i don't have to be mad at my husband but it doesn't matter who you're mad at and who did it baby it's the fact that you got on here two weeks ago and said i don't care what happens i'm never gonna let my kids see me in the bed crying depressed or sad and honey that's all you've displayed ever since you made that video ever since she's made that video telling us that you're not going to see her sad you're not going to see her down you're not going to see it but look it's like a it's like a damn song right why don't you write a song why don't you write an inspirational song why don't you write a song peach about yourself because this um i love effing wood crap and uh, I want to do it every day and i have six kids by them that's why it's so good and you're advertising and advertising honey honey you are it doesn't matter at this point we know fifi said that she uh paid for it off of an app the phone number to contact him but at this point it seems like the number has been out you can contact him on instagram and facebook you said you gave him a shout out and it's all connected together you said that so for every one or two women that you catch him talking to or stop him by talking to them and interrupting how many of those one or two got through i mean i'm just y'all i'm just you know i'm just watching I, that's all so all i can do as a reactor is react on what i see and these are some things that i have seen i ain't going to get into nobody's life no shade no tea i ain't messing with nobody's man i ain't got time to be trying to figure out you know phone numbers and all of that i'm just going by what each woman say at this point i have stepped myself out of it personally and i'm gonna give it to you straight and i'm gonna give it to you raw and i i mean come on y'all if this is something that Peach and Fifi, like I said, came up with and, or have made an agreement on, then I'm going to tell you what. Fifi ain't going to tell my ass. She ain't going to tell my black ass because I asked, okay? But then again, it, don't tell me. Don't tell me. Because, you know, once again, everybody yesterday when we said we were YouTube friends or how we met, y'all said, no, we co-workers. Well, I ain't going to tell my co-worker my business that's going to make my business be good. If, however it went, this is one hell of a come up. She's gaining subs. She's right. I mean, I know her watch time hour. I know her amount of subs. Baby, she in two days has got a channel that's almost monetized and got watch time hours. So either way, it flipped or dipped. It doesn't work somehow. So, you know, I ain't no player hater. I ain't no player hater. I just got to call it how I see it. That uh, this one right here, this Florida streets, he's for the Florida streets. And his own wife said it. He don't like being talked to on no phone. He want it right there in his face. So you know what then? I guess uh, on spring break, boy, spring break in Florida would be having a good time. Uh-huh. Y'all, don't let me be messy no more. I'm being a little messy now. I don't know. All I got to say is, baby, hoo, hoo, hoo. no more pain, no more pain messing with my mind. No, no. <laughs> Look. Or let's just end it like this before I see y'all in the comments. Bing got a bum, still got a bum, keep a bum. Bing got a bum, still got a bum, keep a bum. When I tell y'all, that song right now, baby, should be on the billboards. Uh-huh. That's something we came up when I been first started reacting to Peach. But y'all, let me stop being messy and see y'all in the comments. Y'all got to tell me what y'all think on this one. Uh-huh. Y'all really do. I'll see you below.